Hello, it's Sarah. And I've been wanting to share these stamps that I got with you guys. I got them at joannes.com. Um, they're called Peachy Keen Stamps. And there are several different... Um, this one's called The Blushing Bride. I put my tripod down really low so you could see. The Blushing Bride Interchangeable Faces. This one's called Laffy Taffy Face Assortment. And this one has, like, more and a lot more um, sizes as well. Um, but what I was thinking about was the Prima Doll stamps, obviously. I mean, the little faces. I do have the Julie Nutting stamp that she put out. I'm going to turn my light a little bit. Ah, oh, this light. <laughs> um, and you know what? I love Julie Nutting's products. But these are not the best. They smudge. Every time, sometimes I think these um, polymer stamps have to be um, seasoned almost, they call it. Um, I know Tim Holtz has said if, the, if they don't stamp correctly, you need to dip them in a permanent ink first and kind of maybe even leave it on there and let it kind of get on the plastic. But, I mean, they're dur durable little faces, but they don't it's risky like you would do it first if anything before you did any more work on your doll because you could mess up the face so when I got I, I was really happy with these these are um, the plastic as well they're a little bit in a peachy color so that's cute right peachy keen stamps and they're peachy color so let me show you what I did I just took a piece of this is the Nina solar white cardstock and I just randomly went around um, and did a few of the different size dolls. So the first dolls are the biggest and those are some of her first releases and I don't know the name. I know her name is, one of them is Riley. Here's Riley. So anyway, let's just start. This little face here is this doll here. So she's the bit one of the bigger dolls. A little younger looking and she's got a bigger head. But look how cute this face looks on her. This little smiley eyes one. And it's right here. This is the size of the stamp. And this one I think is from the um, Blushing Bride one. Let me have a look. I, sh I didn't really... Yeah, that's the Blushing Bride. See right there. And it comes in several sizes. All the faces she did in uh, like a bunch of sizes. So, But that's super cute. And I think it fits that doll really, really well. And then I did a couple more with her. This one is, um, I don't think this is the Blushing Bride one. This is the other one. No, it's still the Blushing Bride. Just the big eyes right here. And then this one, look at the totally different take on, that's a different person. I mean, look at the eyebrows are even different. So this is from the other stamp set. This is from the, um, yeah, this is from the Laffy Taffy assortment, and here's the one with the eyebrows, like the different eyebrows, see? So, I thought these two sets particularly had a nice variety of faces. I love the wink, too. There's a wink one I'll show you. Um, so, here's the next girl. Her head is a little bit smaller, and it's this doll. Her, I don't, this is before they had names, but it's this one. These are some of the beginning ones, but I wanted to start with the biggest faces first. So I did, I only stamped her out once, but I thought, and I tried to use like a different face each time. I think this is from the Laffy Taffy one too, um, with the straight eyes. I don't know. All these faces are either from Laffy Taffy or, um, blushing bride here it is right here so you can see these two are about the same size stamp that i used for those faces but then here's riley and riley is my one of my faves i've done i did my uh, mixed media canvas with riley and she's just super cute so here she is um did i do any more of riley no but this is just a little bit smaller. You can see the difference in size. But I think that fits her really well. And there are several of those size, um, different faces in that size. So, like, let's see. That's not it. Here it is. So that whole bottom row is that size. So there's a lot of options. There's a wink. There's, um, 
just a big laugh with eyes closed, like bigger than that. I'll show you. I think I, I have them on the other side. So that's Riley. All right, so those are the bigger heads. Then I'm going to turn it around and go to the next kind of size down. Um, let's see. So here's Kira, I think her name is. Hold on. Oh, Taylor. Look at Taylor with the wink. I just think that is super cute. Oh, I'm moving my, my stamps are sticking. But look at the wink. And even this one with her smiley eyes. I mean, they are super adorable. Even though her eyebrows kind of go up to the to the headband. I just think that is so cute. They really suit her, you know? It looks like it's her, you know? So then there's um, the pageant girl, I call her. These are the ones that didn't have names, but you know, this one with the crown on. So her face is a little smaller, but look how adorable this face is. Now the thing is, I did it twice, the same face, but you have to really touch down gently, but see how much clearer the eyes look on this one. The first one I kind of pushed a little too hard, but look how cute that is. I mean, that really suits her, I think. I think that's like adorable for her. I mean, it's a little blurry still. I would probably, and I'm using, I'm sorry, Memento Tuxedo Black. So if you wanted to color these with your Copic. So that's the size of this stamp. So they're getting smaller. Here's the ones I used with Kira. Or not Kira. I don't know why I keep saying Kira. But see they're getting smaller. So this one's even smaller. So I use that one there. And then this one is, does she have a name? Priscilla. This one with the cool outfit. And she has a like a top hat on. And I did two different stamps for her and I, I don't love them I think this is a little bit she has no chin you know she kind of has no chin this one fits this one's pretty good I think that one could be okay but they're all the same size but there's just not as much room like here's even the last one I think actually the last one is my favorite but that's the smaller version so I think probably these this size doll needs the smaller version because that's a tiny bit smaller. Can you see that? It's a tiny, I think it is. It is. It's a tiny bit smaller. You can tell by the facial um, expression. But there's some really, really sweet expressions. So this is, I just wanted to show you over here. This is actually the Julie Nutting stamps. And they suck. Like, I mean, that, that was the first attempt I did. And it totally smudged. Um, then I just tried to be much more gentle. And they're still not real crisp stamps. They're sweet little faces, and they're only one size as well. So this is the bigger dolls. So you can't get this on your smaller dolls, and there's a lot of smaller dolls. I mean, I still have several that I didn't stamp. Ooh, excuse me. And these are, these are the small dolls. You got her. This one's even tinier. And then you got her. And then these are, I didn't, I didn't think that the, um, the card ones, this is the Lots of Love for the card series, that would fit. I don't think any of them would fit on that, even the smallest of these Peachy Keen stamps. But, so that's all. I just wanted to share these with you guys. Um, there, like I said, there's a couple other sets too, but I just thought that these had enough expressions that I could make some cute dolls with these like I especially love I mean these are just adorable these two and I love this one for her so there's a couple oops falling off don't lose them my dog will eat them this one I love her so cute so they're like real people look I mean look at that one so cute and I didn't even, where's the wink? But I love the wink. Look how cute that wink is. It looks like a, like one of the Archie girls from, uh, <laughs> I'm dating myself, but I'm um, trying to find that stamp before my dog eats it. But anyway, so they're Peachy Keen stamps. And that's it for today, guys. Let me show you. Here they are. Peachy Keen. And I got these at Joann's. And they're peach. So that's it. Thanks for watching.